Hello, I am Gerard, originally from uh, Paris and now Dan Under. Welcome back to the program. I have been cooking and training for many moons. Now retired, it's time to pass my knowledge and secrets to young generation. Today, we are going to make the famous French brioche with eggs. Also, I would like to introduce you my old companion from many years. The Kenwood. The chef. Now I'll show you all the ingredients for the brioche. For the dough, we make uh, we use uh, 500 grams of flour, 150 grams of butter, 150 grams of eggs, three, and 150 grams of milk. Then sugar, 75 grams, and yeast, 15 grams, and just a little spoon of half a spoon of salt because I use salted butter, only just three grams there. We're going now to see how we make the dough. Yeah, just a little note to the readers. If you want to see more uh, about the ingredient and the recipe, you just click on how to make maybe the brioche. You click on this line there and then you see the description and you can scroll down and all my recipe come with a method. If you have an iPhone or a tablet, use it vertically, not horizontally. Now, if you have the internet or the laptop, what you click, you click, you scroll down, and under my name there, okay, you see the recipe, you have to click on show more, all right? And then you see the whole recipe and all ingredients. The first thing to do, I'll be uh, mixing the salt. Try to dissolve the salt with a little bit of the milk. Now, I just warm up the milk at 40 degrees. 41, 40, you see? And then I can mix the yeast. And, and the sugar. And then it'll be bubbling up. Now, I can add the salt to the eggs. Now we're ready, we are starting the brioche dough. First thing we put. Okay, the flour first. Then we put our eggs. All right. And we can start to mix. Ready? As you can see, I put all the liquid part together, the eggs, the salt, the milk and the eggs. As you can see, now it's been mixed and I use of course the hook, not the whisk. Huh? Okay, it's good. Now we're going to add the butter. By now, the butter has been softened and it'll be more easy to mix. As you can see now, the dough, I check with my finger, it's not sticky anymore. When you click, it's coming back. We're ready now to let it rest. Now the dough is removing beautiful, does not stick. It's ready. Little bit of flour, not too much. And we roll. Okay. Yeah, it's look, it's texture is good. So Roll. Okay, like that. Like that. Now, it's beautiful dough. Look at this. You press here, it's coming back. Now, find a warm place in a kitchen near a window where they got sun. We left him here for probably half an hour. We'll see. Now, we're going to use this little uh, mold on top of the eight centimeters in the bottom four okay and up three centimeters you can get your French mold with 10 flattered side in Australia at Chef Itzanzo 
Now we're going to um, oil the mold and I'm using this new uh, cake release. It's amazing. You spray it doesn't stick and you don't have to add flour. Let's try. Put a little bit like oil. And then you spray all more. And just show you again. It's made by uh, Wilton. It's a cake release. Or you can get it from this company, Chef Essential. See? It's coming up. Now look at this beautiful dough. After uh, 20 minutes or half an hour in the sun. Look at this. Look at this. See, when you pick there, it's not ready yet. What we have to do now? See, after the yeast, we have to fold. Two, three, Now watch, see, the fresh is coming up, the figure print disappear, so it's ready now. Oops, and let it dry. Just a nice little cover and we put it to the sun for another 20 years from now. Look at now, beautiful. See, you fresh, it's okay. Now they still think, or oh, you leave it in the fridge, or you can now cook your brioche. Let's go and cook the brioche right now. Fifty gram each. In the oven. See? They don't stick. Magical. Beautiful brioche. Oh, nice with shame. Oh, 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 nice. Now the beast. Think a little bit. Oh, look inside. Spongy, tender, soft. Look at that. And airy.
Oh, nice. Mmm. They are soft and fluffy. Yeah, very nice. Mmm. Very tasty. Soft and fluffy. Mm. Very nice. Now you can do it. It's your turn. And write to me or send me in your comments if you make a good one. Let me know how it goes. See you later.